insight, seeing as yet the unrecognized, providing extra value are the hallmark of the pros in sale. Let's find out how they do it in today's show. Welcome back to this weekly edition every Friday of the Japan Business Mastery Show. I'm your host, Dr. Greg Story, your corporate coaching and training guy, master trainer, president of Dale Carnegie Training Japan, and best-selling author, Japan Sales Mastery and Japan Business Mastery. My new book, Japan Presentations Mastery, will be released probably within the next couple of weeks. We bring the show to you from our studio in the High Performance Center in Akasaka, in Minatoku, the business center of Tokyo. This is episode number 106, and we are talking about go for the bullseye in sales. Before we get going, a quick word from our sponsor. If you want to sell more and do it more easily, do the Winning with Relationship Selling course. If you can't build trust, no sale. Can't design excellent questions to understand the client's needs, no sale. Can't present the solution convincingly, no sale. Can't handle objections properly, no sale. Can't close, no sale. Master the sales process by doing the winning with relationship selling course now in either Japanese or English. bestseller, Japan Sales Mastery, is the new bible of selling in Japan. To sell to Japanese buyers, you need to create long-term partner-level trust, fully understand Japanese buyers' real needs, convince buyers with your solutions, overcome their hesitation, fear, and doubt, know how to ask for the order, ensure repeat orders. This book is a product of 30 plus years in the trenches, selling in Japan. Order Japan Sales Mastery now. Welcome back. Okay, now it's time for the show. Sorewa ikimasho, so let's get going. The client has a problem and we fix it. Our goods or services are delivered, outcomes are achieved, and everybody wins. Problems and issues are a bit like icebergs, though. There is a lot more going on below the surface than be, can be spotted from the captain's bridge. The salesperson's role is to go after the whole iceberg and not just the obvious bit floating above the waterline. The standard sales interview is based on two models comprising the outer circles surrounding a bullseye. The extreme periphery is the telling is selling model. The second model, the inner circle adjoining the bullseye, is the solution model of providing outcomes that best serve the client based on what the client has understood is their problem. Aligning the fix with the client need in the solution model is the mark of the semi-professional. There's nothing wrong with this model, but what are the rock star sales masters doing? Through their questioning skills, they are on a mission to try and find what nobody else is seeing, including the client. A truly magical client statement would be, oh, I hadn't thought of that or allowed for that. Now that is the bullseye we want to hit right there. The salesperson who can provide that type of perspective, alerting clients to over the horizon issues, provides such value that they quickly become the client's trusted business partner. When salespeople pick up vital strategic and tactical commercial intelligence, it all works. Researching various clients' problems, experiences, triumphs, and disasters is valuable, but 
only if you know how to process the detail. It is very rare for company personnel to do study tours of totally unrelated businesses. Salespeople, however, are floating around businesses and therefore able to see options hidden to others. The ability to select and apply a particularly successful solution in a different context is a commercially valuable skill. How can salespeople get that skill? Take what you have seen working elsewhere for one client in a different company or industry, and then apply it for your current client. Another way to get that skill is to do practical research. Based on what you already know, build up a point of view on an industry. Check it against what your clients are telling you or conduct company surveys. We won't always be able to conjure up a bullseye. However, in trying to do so, our aspirations, general direction and thinking will be correct. In sales, the innermost circle, the big red bullseye leads straight to the winner's circle. And that is where we must be. Let's make insight our springboard to success. I hope you enjoyed today's show and so please subscribe on YouTube, share with your family, friends and colleagues, become a regular. Hit the little bell icon to receive update notifications. Our website details are on screen now www.dale-carnegie.co.jp It's packed with value so certainly check it out. We try to offer as much value as possible, so you might also enjoy our other shows. In fact, we are releasing content six days a week for podcast Mondays for the Cutting Edge Japan Business Show, Tuesday for the Presentations Japan series, and every second Tuesday for the Business of Tachijin no Oshie Show, Wednesdays for the Sales Japan series, Thursdays for the Leadership Japan series and every second Thursday for the Business Pro Podcast show, Fridays for the Japan Business Mastery show and Saturdays for Japan's top business interviews. Now you get these wherever you get your podcast. Also, every Monday we release the Cutting Edge Japan Business show. Every second Thursday we release the Business Pro TV show, and every Friday, the Japan Business Mastery Show. Saturdays, every Saturday, we are releasing Japan's top business interviews. These are all on YouTube. We appreciate your support, and please let others know about it so they can benefit too. We want to make a contribution to helping people build their careers and businesses. And so, please join with us in that endeavor. In episode number 207, we are talking about presenting needs rhythm. Onigai Tashimas, please join me next week to master business here because that is what we all want, isn't it? Japan business mastery.